Hi, my name is Brooklyn Golday, and today some students are going to talk about going to talk to you about our chick unit. We studied chicks to learn about the chicken life cycle. It was a lot of fun, and I learned a lot. We would like to thank the Dumond Education Association and the PTO. Both have helped make this project possible. We have worked to make a presentation to teach you about the brooder box incubator, parts of, a, parts of an egg, and some other stuff. Hope you like it. Hi, my name is Elias. I will tell you about the incubator. Since there is no hen to keep the chicks or eggs warm, we put them in the incubator. The incubator is a box that keeps the eggs warm for 21 days. The incubator is about 400 degrees front height, like a hen. We had to set up a few days ahead to regulate the temperature. Then during the last week, this week, just so water was added for humidity or moisture. It is important for the egg to be humid placed while the eggs hatches. Hi, my name is Quinn and I'm going to talk to you about caring for eggs. Our eggs come from a hatchery and we know that they're all hatching eggs, not like the ones from the grocery store. First, we have to put X's and O's on both sides of the eggs and put them in the incubator. The X's and O's are for flipping the eggs. We have to flip them three times a day for 18 days. Students get to flip the eggs at the start of school, at the end of school, and at night a teacher has to flip them. It takes 21 days for a chick to hatch. We have to be careful not to bump the incubator because the eggs would roll. We also have to be careful not to drop the eggs when flipping them. We had to be we had to wash our hands before and after touching the eggs because of germs. We didn't want to spread germs to the growing chick or get germs from the chick. That is all about egg care. Hey, my name is Caleb. I am going to tell you about the parts of the egg. The first part is the shell. The shell is a hard covering of the egg, and it protects it so it won't break easily. The second part is the shell membranes. The membranes provide defense against germs. Then the albumin is the egg white. It gives the old chick the it gives the chick water, protein, and vitamins. The yolk provides the grown chick with food. The chalage is kind of like a string that makes the yolk stay in place. Then there is a white spot where the growing chick begins to grow inside the egg. There is also an air sac and it helps the growing chick breathe. Hi, my name is Jack Heredia, and I'm here to tell you about chicks hatching. It takes 21 days for a chick to hatch, and on day 19, the chick takes its first breath using the air pocket. On day 21, the chick makes its pip. A pip is the first peck at the egg shell. The chick uses its egg tooth to peck its way all the way around the shell. Then the chick uses its feet and head to get out of the shell. The chick is wet and tired after it is done. It takes two hours for the chick to dry. The chick is now hungry after it hatches because the yolk gives the chick nutrients. That's how the chick hatch, hatch, hatches. I hope you liked it. Hi, I'm Alana and this is my presentation about the brooder box. The brooder box is another place where a chick can grow after it hatches out of the egg. Inside the brooder box has warmth, food, a place to move around, places to sleep, and where to drink. The water ball has to be a special water ball though because it has to allow enough water to come out into the bowl, but make sure that the chips can't fall in and drown. There are papers lying the bottom because the brooder box, the brooder box because the chicks are messy. The chicks will stay in the brooder box until they are sent to live with the farmer. And this is the brooder box. During our, during our unit, we used our habits. We had to use think win win while we took care of the chicks because everyone got to take turns while holding and playing with the chicks. You just had to wait your turn and be patient. I hope you learned a lot today. Are, are there any questions? Yes. Are parents allowed to hold a chick? Before you 
I don't have my questions. Yes. Does anyone have a favorite chick? Um, Lyric. Oh, um, pretty much everybody. Wow. <laughs> okay. I didn't have poop down when I was on the group. One more question. <clears throat> why didn't uh, no one has a name for a chick? You, I think you told oh, me why not. Because it's going to the farmer, and we don't want like, to have the name for them because it's going to the farmer. Get attached. Okay. Thank you. Are they all the same breed of chickens? Mm, um, I guess no, maybe. No, no, not exactly. Because one of them is a yellow chick and the rest are black. And what is the black one? Can you tell them what that one is? The, the black one is the water rooster. Um, and then oh, the yellow one is like um, the hen. We don't know what the yellow one is. I've never had that one before. <laughs> Well, I just wanted to say that I'm very impressed with the children and what they've learned because I actually, maybe I learned about the chicks when I was younger or even when I went to college, but uh, I learned about the eggs that she taught me some things that I wasn't familiar with. Pretty cool. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> it was just being so feisty. He's feisty, all right. He's so feisty. Not a big fan of him, right? <laughs> oh, there's mommy back there. <laughs> Really shaking, huh? Yeah. Oh, Are you scared? Well. Or maybe it's purring. Maybe. He <laughs> likes to pick on you. Should we put him back? <laughs> I know, but I'm afraid I'm going to drop that. One got loose, Miss B. One got loose on the floor a little bit a minute ago. Because it's in some sauce. Oh, that was in dark coffee for my back. He's coffee. I don't know if anybody's coffee. Do you want a little bit? Oh, that was good. We all learned something. I'm stuck with the people I know. Oh yeah, was it a bedlam? bedlam? <laughs> Not a whole lot of other learning going on there. But that's all right. I mean, like one right after the other, kind of. Well, it, it takes a couple of days. All of them. Okay. And one more shot of this bee there, and we'll go. Is that 